President Harry S. Truman delivers a warning of the blows that are yet to fall upon Japan. The Japanese now know that their dreams of conquest are shattered. They no longer boast of dictating peace terms in Washington. This does not mean, however, that the Japanese have given up hope. They are depending on America tiring of this war, becoming weary of the sacrifices it demands. They hope that our desire to see our soldiers and sailors home again and the temptation to return to the comforts and profits of peace will force us to settle for some compromise short of unconditional surrender. They should know better. They should realize that this nation, now at the peak of its military strength, will not relax, will not weaken in its purpose. We have the men, the material, the skill, the leadership, and the fortitude to achieve total victory. We have the allies who will help us achieve it. We are resolute in our determination. We will see the fight through to a complete and victorious finish. To that end, with the help of God, we shall use every ounce of our energy and strength.